Okay, so uh, if I'm gonna be stuck inside for weeks, I thought I'd give this uh, internet thing the old college try, as the kids say. God, I, I remember when personal branding just meant you fell asleep with a cigarette in your mouth. And Coco has, what, like 150,000 followers? Poor it for a shock if they ever catch up to her. <laughs> Being stuck at home for weeks can drive you crazy if you don't have a hobby. And mine is drinking. Always has been. As a matter of fact, my favorite bar, Morty, is even named a drink after me. The E.V. Harris. <laughs> it's three parts anything. I had to stop going there even before this because of the getting home thing. I once uh, killed a guy drunk walking. Yeah, I fell on him. He fell in the street and a bus ran him over was a woman who cracked her head open on a fire hydrant. <laughs> the human mind. <laughs> but anyway, now that I have to be home all the time, drinking alone isn't a red flag anymore. So on the test of the five signs you have an alcohol problem, I only get a four. There are some tricks to it, though, that I'd like to share with you. For instance, to stretch provisions. Practice what I call third drink first. Instead of whipping up something fancy with cranberry juice and ice, just start right off with what would have been your third drink. A straight shot of whatever's on the counter. <laughs> I mean, we're alone, right? Who are we trying to impress? <laughs> uh, lights out wall goals that aren't even real? <laughs> It's more important than ever not to waste liquor, so pour all your drinks while you still see one of everything. Oh, and this is very important. Uh, put them on something you can't pass out onto. So, uh, no coffee tables or refrigerator shelves. Oh, you know what no one tells you about alcoholism? It's fucking expensive. And don't believe what friends and judges tell you about drinking either. It's fine. I actually got my big break in showbiz because of drinking. Yeah, I got this nothing little part in a Chuck Chaplin flick and decided to play her drunk. Well, turns out I act better drunk. <laughs> After that, I'd always work drunk. While the crew would set up my shot, I'd slink off to my trailer and have a great big bourbon. <laughs> Used to call it my lighting double. You somebody's know what I'm talking about. Still, I don't know how much more of this I can take. I've been stuck in here by myself for I don't know how many weeks, but <laughs> you can't go out or people will see the scars. Wait a minute.